Hey guys, good morning. So I'm doing something I don't normally do, and that's um, chilling with you guys and recording a video on a Sunday. What? So the reason behind that is because we have this 2X Ancients event going on, and I'm a glutton for punishment because, you know, it has to do here with getting this uh, Supreme Elaine. Now, those of you guys that know me is Fusion Champs, the Fragma Fusion ones, right? I do tend to go for them. Supreme Elaine, yeah, we're gonna go for her. Like I said, I guess I'm just a glutton for punishment. So here we are on a Sunday. I do have, we do know it's a champion chase, by the way, guys, which is a great time to pull, like if you have any of these fragment champs, which you guys see that I do. Plus, I also have a lot of mystery shards. So the plan for today is I do have some ancient shards. We're gonna end up pulling these, see if I get anything decent in here. Then, you know, then if I have to pull my fragments, then if I also have to do some of the mystery shards, I will. It also happens to be champion training, which is great. So anything that I'm pulling here is gonna help me with that anyway, which is totally fine now the last time i did pull ancients i did get what did i get i got the gorilla so samson i ended up getting samson and it was kind of an accident you know what i mean so with that i'm not really sure what's gonna happen but you know here we go i would love a duchess of course duchess georgie teogo yeah teodor those guys would be great so i'm gonna pull three singles then we're gonna do some ten pulls but i hope you guys are having a, a great sunday like i said i don't normally do this and I decided I was going to grab some breakfast to hang out with you guys. So I went to Panera, hashtag not sponsored, by the way. And I ended up getting a free dessert on my rewards card. So there's a cinnamon roll for me. What? Score, right? And I do love breakfast sandwiches. So here we go. 10. So I'm sitting here with this sausage, egg, and cheese sandwich, as you guys can see here. And I have my coffee as well. So I'd love to know how you guys are doing today. So we have Vala and Farrakhan. Bella and Farrakhan, you know. Again, I'm gonna be using most of these rares, I'm assuming, for champ training anyhow, most likely. And of course, guys, I do have, I got my Madrina's coffee here. Luckily, keep me fueled. All right, three epics here. Deathless, Arndolf, and Rain Beast. Don't need any of these. Again, the epics will be good for my champ training. But uh, yeah, guys, let me know. Uh, let me know how your day is going. I would love to hear, are you pulling shards for for this fragment fusion, or are you avoiding it? I do know I saw some of the other CCs ended up pulling from, the oh, Lego! Oh my goodness, we got Silly and the Lucky. <laughs> now, you know what's so funny with him? All right, I don't have him, now I do. What's really funny with him, his lore story is hilarious. By the way, if you guys haven't checked it out, Okay, well, Silly and the Lucky is new for me, so that does help me with Elaine. How about that, right? We do have he hits twice and has a decreased speed, also the chance of stealing the turn meter. A2 is an AoE block active skills. A3 is called Head Ringer, has a chance for a stun. And let's see, steals target's turn meter resets if the target is killed. Charmed Life places two of the following buffs at random, it looks like. And the ally attack in all battles by 25%. That is really funny, you guys, because honestly, I wasn't really sure what I was expecting here. I don't know. But his lore story is hilarious. Basically, he kind of just like bumbles and stumbles through life and gets lucky. <laughs> That's his story. And Dahlia, I actually feel like Dahlia might be new for me for this account. I think she might be. That's a good take a look, but I feel like she might be. Leave me some comments, guys. Are you getting some Legos? Are you avoiding this altogether? Or what do you know? What do you guys got going on? Hope. Okay. All right. So that looks like that's all my ancient shards. We did end up getting ourselves Cillian. Plus, we got a whole bunch of epics and some rares. Let me see where we are at points wise, because it is going to determine what else I do. Let's see, Champ Chase. Ooh, we're doing really well, look at that. I just need another 500 points. So, what I'm most likely going to do is I'm probably gonna pull, I could pull one Lego. I'll have to decide if I wanna do this, or like I said, it also happens to be Champ Training. So I'm okay with pulling like a bunch of mystery shards, leveling them up, sacrificing them and such like that. But guys, leave me some comments down below. How did you do on this event? Hope you have a wonderful Sunday. Thank you so much for joining. Have a great day.